What's up you guys? Welcome or welcome back to All Things Ange. I'm here with another video for you guys today. And as you can see by that title and that thumbnail, we got us another unboxing. So if you guys don't know about Alta's mini fragrance sets please allow me to put you on because i didn't even know about these until this spring so apparently ulta drops them every season it's basically the most popular perfumes they'll put all the mini bottles into a set for like fifty dollars you can legit get like this one is seven pieces and i think it was probably like 45 dollars they've done some with like up to 13 or maybe like 50 dollars i was fortunate enough to catch the holiday one so they actually dropped three sets this holiday season they did a holiday fragrance minis and then they did the holiday scents for her. And then they also did a holiday fragrance crush set. That one had the most fragrances in it. I ordered that one, but then they said it was sold out. So it's whatever. I'm just glad I got my hands on these two. Y'all know I am a perfume girly. I love me some perfume. I love to smell good. That is like a top tier compliment for me. When I tell you I've literally had people chase after me just to tell me I smell good and ask me what I'm wearing. So yeah. I also have a video on my channel of my current perfume collection. So make sure you guys check that out. But for right now, let's just get into these y'all. So I'm super excited. I'm so, so, so excited. I cannot wait to unbox it. So I think I'm going to do... Which one should I do first? I don't even know. I'm going to do this one first because it has more. Yeah. So we're going to do the holiday scents for her. Let's go on ahead and unbox this. <clears throat> All right. Here she is. It comes with nine pieces nine mini fragrance bottles i think this one was 50 and the other one was 45 came super quick too i ordered them i think like this week i ordered them like sunday today's friday and they are still in stock right now i'm going to try to have this video up tomorrow because it's not going to take me that long to edit i know i always unbox things for you guys that are like you know good um sale items that by the time i upload the video it'd be sold out so it's like girl what's the point but this time i'm gonna make sure i upload them in time so this is what it looks like i just pulled out some tissue and then oh my gosh and then the mini bottles are so cute super excited let's let's just get right into it oh my gosh all right so i'm gonna do oh did i do this one we got the giorgio armani my way I might as well just go ahead and start with this one. Oh my gosh, the mini bottles are so cute. How cute is that? How cute is that? So yeah, this is the Giorgio Armani on my way. It's not a spray. It's just like a little, little dabber. Hmm. it smells nice it smells really clean it's not like a floral scent it's really like crisp and clean i like it yeah i like this i'll keep this one there's no way i know i'm not keeping all of these thankfully like you know holiday season is right around the corner so i'm definitely gonna gift some of these but i think this is gonna be one that i keep yeah, it's giving very much clean, girl. Like, this is the scent I will wear if I, like, just got out the shower, like, before I go to bed type of scent. Just, like, chilling in the house. This is a very nice, calm scent. I really like this. Giorgio Omani My Way. Okay. All right, next. Ooh, I heard a lot of things about the, um, the Billie Eilish perfume. Let's see. Let's see, Billy. So yeah, this is the Billy Eilish Eilish number two. Number two. Love the packaging. Love that. Super cute. 
Okay, so I don't think any of them are sprays. They just like, it's just like a little dropper, if you guys can see. So, oops, I'm spilled out. Aww. I don't like it. It's a no for me. I don't like this one. It, it kind of, I can't really explain what it smells like either. Mmm. I don't like that. It doesn't smell bad. I just don't like it. <laughs> no, that's not a, mm -mm. that's not a fragrance for me. Aw, Billy. I'm trying to be sure too. Like, no, it's, I can't, it has like a spice to it. If that makes sense. If y'all, if y'all use this perfume, if you like this one, comment down below. It has like a, yeah, like a spice to it. I really can't explain it. Wait, let me see. On the box. A sultry and sensual scent. Fresh Italian bermagat and apple blossom draw you into a seductive aroma. Drenching you in a woody, earthy spiciness of papyrus and black pepper. You see? I know I'm not bugging. I know my scent. It literally smells like a spice. Yeah. That's exactly what it smells like. So y'all y'all nailed that. Um, a contrast of wild wet poppy flowers flows into the base of Palo Santo Ebony expertly wrapped in metallic. Okay. Yeah, no. It's not for me. <laughs> that's but they nailed the scent though. That's really what it smells like. It literally says woody earthy spiciness of papyrus and black pepper. Y'all put black pepper in this? Like it literally, yeah, no, this isn't for me. This will be getting regifted, but um, it's for somebody. It's not for me, but it's for somebody. Um, let's get into the dulce. Oh, this I don't know if y'all could tell, but the box is like a velvety. It's like a velvety texture. That's really nice. So this is the Dolce & Gabbana Light and Blue. Light and Blue is definitely what it's giving. Let's see. Hold on, I'm gonna dab some that. <laughs> Damn, that Billie Eilish one kind of fucked up my nose. Not gonna lie, cause all I smell is straight seasoning now. Let me see. I'm gonna dab some on the cardboard and try to, to like really get the scent. It's not strong. I don't think I'm a fan of this one either. Well, at least I know they'll make good gifts. Let's do Clinique next. Cute packaging. Cute and simple. <gasps> it's a spray! Yay, it's the first one that's a spray. I'm happy about that. Alright, don't disappoint me. It's nice, but I don't think I will wear it. I don't I don't think I will wear this one. Let's just get right into the Prada. Because this is the one I'm most excited for. So yeah. I opened her Prada Intense. Cute. Love the bottle. Super cute. Okay. Don't fail me. This one is a um a drop or two, I can tell, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Oh yeah. Yep. <laughs> it's giving exactly what it's supposed to give. It's like it's like rich and deep and like fruity it's like i feel like it would stay on me all day because you know a lot of scents i feel like don't stay i like this one mm. all right next we got flower bomb this is um victor and rolf vic toy and rolf i've never heard of them so let's see Ooh, she's cute. She's cute. 
I think my mama like this. It's okay. It's definitely floral, but it doesn't really smell like it has all of those flowers in it. It's cool though. I think I would, I think I'll hold on to this one. Ooh, Mugler. I'm excited for this one. I didn't even know this one was in there. Let's see. Yeah. Woo! Packaging. I don't even know which is... Okay, this gotta be the front. Packaging. Fire. It literally looks like a giant jewel. Come on, Mugler. Don't, don't disappoint. I'm excited for you. I can't even open this. interesting it's very interesting hold on i don't know if it's me or if it's like my note but the scents aren't like i can't really get like a good whiff of it I think I like this one though. It's giving like rich auntie vibes. Like classy, classy, classy rich auntie vibes. Like I obviously wouldn't wear this every night. So now we have Radiant Grace. Never heard of this either. Come on. There we go. Yeah. Radiant Grace. Let's see what she gives. Ooh. Super cute packaging. Come on, can we talk about these mini bottles? They are so cute. And I think that's why this set is so popular because they also do this with like the samplers. You know, the samples are just like the little spray bottles. But the fact that they actually give them minis, oh, it's just so like aesthetically pleasing. It's so cute. So yeah, this is Radiant Grace Philosophy. I hope I'm saying the names of all of the fragrances i'll go i'll go back i'll link these two in the description box because they are also still in stock like right now so i'm gonna link them let me try this hand mm. Mm. i like i like okay I like scents where I just like them right away. You know, sometimes things have to grow on me, but I like when I just like them right away. Yeah. Mmm. This one smells yummy. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, really great. I've never heard of them. Okay, and last but not least, we have Toka. Toka. I think this one is a roll-on. And you know, we love a good roll-on. Come on, focus. I don't know if y'all can see. But yeah, Toka Lucia. I love me a roll-on. Hold on. I hate these boxes. Okay. Ooh. Pretty. Here she is. This is what she's getting. Wait, is it a roll-on? No, it's a spray. Cool. I'd rather. I'm not mad at the spray. This is what she's giving. Hmm. Interesting. It's so... Oh, no. Mm-mm. Sorry, Bella. She's looking at me like, girl, what are you doing? Oh, no. Sorry, Bella. She just got a whiff of the scent. I'm sorry. She's about to start sneezing. Tribute to Italian tradition of dolce and far... What? Lemon and woody? Yeah. I don't think I like this one. Again, not bad sense, just not for me. Yeah. I don't think I like that one. 
All right, so now we've got the holiday fragrance minis. There's a couple in here that I'm really excited for too. This one only has seven. The other one had nine. This one was a 45, I believe. So let's get into her. And then we get into one. So we have the YSL Black Opium. I'm excited for that one too. Okay, so might as well. I got her in my hand. You might as well start with her. Mm. Yeah. Super, super cute packaging. So yeah, this is YSL Black Opium. I think, I think it'll go on me. I'll give this one a chance. You know when you smell something for the first time and it's kind of like, I think my nose is just kind of like overwhelmed right now from all of the scents, but I think I'm going to let her grow on me. It's not bad. I think I'm going to do this um, classic, clean classic spring breeze. This one is a roll on, which I'm excited for. Let's see what she's hitting for. Cute little, cute little roll on. Mmm. Mmm. I like. Oh, wait. Mmm. It kind of smells like a baby wipe. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, it kind of smells like a scented baby wipe, but I like it. Yeah, this is the scent I will put on, like, right after I get out the shower before I get in the bed. I like it. Um, let's get into the Dolce. Dolce and Gabbana Devotion. Okay, let's see. Oh, it says on the back, candy, citrus, orange, blossom, vanilla. Okay. Oh, this bottle is so cute. Look at her. Oh, she's cute. She is cute. Okay. Okay, do What is it going to give? I don't like it. It's not a bad, it's definitely not a bad scent, but I don't like it. Mm. Mm -mm. Okay, so now we have Ellis Brooklyn Myth. Let's see what she gets. Oh, I could kind of smell this one right out of the pack. Is it a roll-on? She is a roll-on. Get into it. All right now. I like. Okay, these last three. All right, all right let's just get I'm going to just do... And you're just going to do Estee Lauder, Beautiful Mongolia. Excited for her. Beautiful packaging. <gasps> it's a spray. Period. She's a spray. Love that. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Most deaf. Most deaf. Keeping her. Okay, second to last, we got Versace. Versace Bright Crystal. Super cute packaging. 
of course. Get into it. I think I'm gonna give her a chance though. I can't really smell it, so I'm gonna give her a chance. And of course, I saved the one that I am most excited for for last. We got the Valentino born in Roma. Been seeing this everywhere. Oh, she's so cute. Oh, she's so cute. It doesn't say anything on the bottle. It's just, she's still the cutest though. All right. What is it going to give? Yep. I like her. It smells really yummy. I, sp I dabbed it in a weird place in my hand, but. I do like. So. Out of the seven scents that were in this one, I like five of them. The only two I really don't like was, and I don't even think I didn't like this one. I just think I'm gonna, I'm just gonna give it. I don't, I don't see myself using it. It's not that I don't like it. I just don't think I'm gonna use it. The Clean Classic Spring Breeze and the Dolce and Gabbana Devotion. So these two will be gifted as well, but not too bad. Seven fragrances for $50. I think like one of these mini bottles can be like $30 to $40. And then you just got like seven of them for $50. No, this was $45. So yeah. And then shout out to Ulta for doing this too because I think that it's a great way for you to be able to try out perfumes. Like a bunch of different perfumes at once which i love i will definitely be copying the next one so make sure you guys run down to Ulta right now don't walk run because these sets are fire and this is just the holiday fragrance ones they do one every season it seems like the spring one that they did this year was so iconic so yeah them super great buy you know we love a good unboxing but yeah thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed make sure you like comment and subscribe turn on that post notification bell so you're notified every time i post and i will see you guys in my next video